like I was saying, the first thing that, that, that struck me was that you need a big anarchy symbol, which is really not become so important in the piece as, as other things did. But then the other things I would, that hit me straight away was, uh, I suppose it's a generational thing, I was thinking Lenny the Lion, well, you, could need, you need a Lenny in there somewhere, which is quite, <laughs> well, I thought it was obvious, but you were saying earlier on it's not so obvious. So I thought, well, you need a Lenny in there somewhere, that's one of the most obvious things. Then you also need a Simba, because that's, almost, that's also one of the most obvious things. So then I'm thinking, well, how are you going to get Lenny and Simba? And with graffiti art, graffiti artists come along and spray something on the wall. Then later on, or the next day, someone comes along and sprays something over the top of it. And then someone comes along and sprays something over the top of that. So you get this overlapping, like you've got these yellow letters that have gone underneath the white letters, which have gone underneath the pink letters. And then people have sp sprayed things on the top of that. So you get this weird... and and. Most of the time you can't read what it says anyway because their tags and logos are so strange. But even when you can read it, it gets covered up and covered up. So it's very difficult to work out what it is. But what I'm trying to do with a painting like this is I'm trying to make it just possible to work out what it, what it actually says. With the letter, with these yellow letters here, it really doesn't matter. You never, I, don't, I don't know what that says. But with the, the white, I want you to try and work out, and it takes a bit of doing, but that's an S. Then behind there, there's, there's a, what's this? There's a dot on top of what is a, it must be a letter I, and that's definitely an M. Then the B here, this was strange because the B then has gone round the, the corner into the doorway there, so that plays with the perspective, which, you know, when you paint the picture, you have to stop and think about how that works. And then somebody's, you know, graffiti painted the A, which is doing the, the opposite thing, coming back out again on, on you know, where the, the doorway comes out. But you've got S-I-M-B-A. So you've got Lenny and Simba, which were, to me, the most important names to have on the painting. But then I would try to get everything else in as well. I've not got everything else in. You know, there's loads of stuff I could have done. Anyway, there you go.